Robert Foster with Spartan Mowers. We are so excited. Hi, to go off the new what are you doing? What are you doing, girl? What are you doing? Trying to film. Are you making one of those cool videos? I'm making one. Where you video. talk about the mower? I was talking about the new XD, that this is my personal mower. That's what I was talking about. Whoa, that's why it's so fancy. It's fancy. You know what I think people want to see? What? How you build these. Well, hey, let's, uh, let's, let's do a little change up today. Instead of us showing you all the advantages of a Spartan, we're going to show you how we build a Spartan. So let's, uh, you want to go receiving first? Yes. Receiving first. Let's go. Behind the scenes tour. Yep. With owner Robert Foster. <laughs> Check it out, people. What do you think? This is huge. Yeah. I mean, this is huge. Like, how many truckloads of stuff are in here? I'm not for sure, but I would just somehow, uh, you know, thinking about around 300 truckloads. You are kidding me. Yeah, and then we flow parts from the other manufacturing facility um, uh, at, um, that uh, all the metal parts come into here that we laser cut, form, break, paint. They all come in this building. I they bet all people come don't right know down that. Here. We have two locations. We yeah. fab, we paint, we do, uh, we bend, we cut, we bend, we fab, we paint. Yeah. That should yeah. be a t-shirt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then we bring it on over here. Yeah, yeah. So and let's we, uh, look through receiving. Yeah, we bring loads in here all day long. This facility, this oh, is where the receiving is. Backwards. And then we end up going into the, to the, uh, to the assembly plant. And then we show you the distribution center. But uh, we have about uh, right at eight, eight acres under roof. So, so we have a lot of square footage. So our deal is, is to be lean manufacturing so that we can put more trinkets on the mower, save money, and uh, give all of our customers an unbelievable deal. So basically you're saying you want to build the best product out there for the best value. Hey, you got that right. Okay. Always, always the best value. <laughs> Let's go here to receiving. If you can show right here the forklifts, moving down through here. This is live action. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm proud our safety didn't have to get involved in that one right there. It looked like almost an ear crash. <laughs> So let's we get down here. We would have caught here. it on camera. Yep. Now we do pick up trash as we go through the shop. This is not just for the video. This is legit how he operates at all yep. times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, so all the parts flow into here. Uh, we, we have our supervisors in this area here, all of our so these are offices. This is offices right okay. here. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, and then, so everything flows in here. They 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 check all the parts in. You can see right up here, stuff coming in and out. We're just getting a load of Vanguard engines in up here. So um, that uh, all the trucks flow in here. All of our non-fabricated parts and all of our fa fabricated parts all flow in this area. So then, what if, you, if you look down here, here, look at all the engines, all the hydros down this way right here. If you'll get a Holy shot right down smokes. here. Holy smokes! Uh, we have lots and lots of parts down here, so. So check out at, all these yeah, engines. Yeah, look at these engines right up here. These engines up here are, uh, we have lots and lots. This whole entire back wall is solid engines, plus we have another, our other facility over to the other uh, campus. Uh, we have a lot of other engines and you know fuel tanks, plastic, everything over there too. So we, we have another, uh, uh, area over there where all the parts flow into if it's all the overstock items so this is amazing so when he's talking about the other plant too it's literally just around the corner like as half, a the, mile, half, half a mile half a mile half a mile half as a mile. the crow yeah. flies yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay so we should show them where the magic happens yes, right yes 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 yeah this is uh um this area here we're fixing to go to is the is the assembly plant uh it's where everything is put together so after it's fabbed after it's laser cut form break weld it painted it comes into here, then it goes against this back wall. Once it goes against the back wall, it's, it's, it's needed to, for the assembly lines to flow. So, so once we get them in um, the parts here flowing, we can build a machine really quick. So we're gonna show you coming off the line what we're able to do, if we get there before lunch. <laughs> before they take a break. <laughs> before they take a break. So that's the other thing too, it's gonna be a little noisy. So we're gonna do our best, but yep. we just thought it'd be cool to kind of show you like a behind the scenes of yep. how it all works. So the so, cool thing is you've got sections of people that are sub-assembling stuff. Yeah, yeah, right over here, right over here is sub-assembly. So, so this whole middle section right here is a sub-assembly. So the sub-assemblies, they flow the parts to the assembly line 
And uh, anything that they can partially put together that makes it faster on the assembly line makes it go very, very well. So, so we're uh, reels. Uh, everything that we look at at the plant is is done by seconds, uh, and uh, we want to be the leanest manufacturing company on the planet. So, so, so the more that we can, the more lean we can be, the the uh, we we still are going to make mistakes. You know, I mean, I, Janelle might not make mistakes. I mean, but, I try but, not but to, we but. still make mistakes sometimes. But, but, but we've but instituted the double check system. Yes, yes. So, so what, what we do here at, um, at Spartan now, we uh, Intimidator. What, what we do, uh, the plant manager has its own inspectors. So, so, so they get they they go through the line, and uh, they get built. Oh, they come off the line. They get inspected, and then the quality has their own inspectors. So they get double inspected. So every machine we got gets 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 uh, uh, drove by the by the plant managers inspectors and by the quality inspectors. So it so it's uh, I'm not saying that we don't ever make mistakes. We do, but but this this ensures a you know a super high quality part. I don't I don't know of anybody in the industry that uh, that 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 goes that far. So all the machines, the blades are turned on. They're all drove. Uh, uh, they're all put on a uh, on a tilt table. So uh, a lot going on here. Let's show them the shipping area. You want to? Yeah yeah let's. Let's head right up through here, so. Anything else you want to tell people about the assembly? Um, we can show a, show a glimpse in here of the, oh, right there, yeah. Check out our executive conference yep, room. Yep, here's our conference room here. So. Also, Robert has an office, an but office he here. honestly doesn't even use it. Yeah, now I don't hardly ever come in here, but this is my office. But uh, I, I love building stuff, so I'm, I'm mainly in research and development. Seriously, it's like the most amazing office ever. And I don't even think the computer's connected to the internet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I did steal a battery out of your clock so that we could make this video. Oh, no. <laughs> so I borrowed the battery so that clock goes back on the wall. Oh, check out our scissors from our ribbon cutting. <laughs> Isn't that so cool? Yeah. I love it. Yeah. All right, let's show Come on down here. Come on down here. Anything else you want to tell them about the line while we're going down? Yeah, that. Um, yeah, we right here. As you can see, there's there's different stations here. So all up the line right here, each person ha has a set a set thing to do on the line. So as they flow up, just more and more parts get put on the line until it comes off here at the end. So, so if you can look, uh, even look in here at our offices here. Uh, we have, I think there's, I think there's five or six coffee bars through the plant. Uh, we have uh, have it so that all the offices are all open, so that every single person in the plant can be seen uh, uh, as you walk by. This is called the chicken coop. And so me and Jack Ragel, we end up doing chicken in here. And so what, every time we break a new record, something big happens. We end up uh, serving chicken here. So. Uh, but we, we, we love doing this. We're, we're set up a whole lot like Chick-fil-A inside. We have the fresh cookers. We do nuggets, tenders. Uh, we, we do spicy, it's regular, amazing. grilled, toaster buns, the sweet tea. We do it. We got it all going on here. So. <laughs> He's got it perfected. So a lot of people come to Spartan Intimidator. They want to work here just because of chicken sandwiches. <laughs> so this is our Spartan theme right here. So, so, so we have an intimidator theme on that end of the building. This is our Spartan theme right here. So, so very, very handy, very convenient for for our awesome, dedicated team Employee. members to come here and get whatever they need. Works we out very, very that good. Old timey look to the mural. It looks amazing. It turned out great. Yeah, we don't only have coffee at six or seven spots through the place. We got Miss Doris' famous sweet tea right over here. It's legit the best. Yep. All right, what are we looking at over here? Yeah, we're, we're here at the front of the mower line. Here's where the mowers come off the tables at the next level. They come here. This in here is just about fixing to pull off right here. If you'll get right over here, shine over here. This right here is just fixing to pull off. Go ahead. And so this machine here has just been finished. So, so as they come off the lines here, they get in line, they go over here for inspection. Right here, these mowers, literally, somewhere between around three and a half minutes, you know, these machines come off the line. So That's it, incredible. Yeah, 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 when you think about building a complete big heavy duty machine like this in three and a half minutes is 
it's pretty crazy. The first machine I built, you know, took me like three months. So that's more like childbirth. Yeah, yeah. Now you just got them coming out. That's right, that's right, that's right. <laughs> kind of like having triplets. Yeah, like having triplets. <laughs> yeah. Hey, yeah. do people at home know that we have our own Spartan branded oil? Oh yeah. You need to ask your dealer about this. Hey, that's not only Spartan branded, that's done with Amsoil. So that's a synthetic it's Amsoil. Good stuff. It's good, good stuff. We only put the best in our Spartan mowers. So uh, you see these coming off the line every three and a half, four minutes. Then where do we put them? So let's go look and see where we put them. Check it out. Now here's the thing. How are we gonna sell all these? Well, the thing about all these mowers here, they're, they're already sold. So dealers are waiting on these mowers. We have some dealers that's completely out of mowers. So, so these dealers, they're selling the Spartan mowers, unbelievable, and uh, a lot of dealers are having to wait. So, so you customers that are waiting at your Spartan dealer for the truck to come in, we're working mega hours. Everybody's doing everything they possibly can. We've, uh, we've even went to each... Uh, 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 every department. Every in department. I was looking for departments <laughs> what I was looking for. That was every a tough department one there. in the company has said, hey, we will donate the time of a person out of our department to help build mowers. So we've got people from marketing, we've got people oh, from sales, sales, sales yeah, all we, yeah. over the plant, and they said, yeah. I will step yeah, up quality, and I will help you. Everybody come in to help on the line. So, so we wanted to get people that had worked on the line before, our sub-assembly that had already had experience, so we could start a line up really quick and uh, have very high quality machines coming off it's of it. It's been amazing. It's been amazing, you know, for team building, for, for everyone to have to give up someone out, out of their department, it's been really big. So we're very thankful for, 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 our, for our team. We have the most unbelievable team on the planet. Uh, you know, uh, I'm so, so thankful for the group that we have because that no matter what it takes, we're gonna get it done. So we're gonna get the machines to you no matter what it takes. I'm saying I look in here and I feel like this looks like an army ready to go to battle. Yeah, yeah that, uh, there's a, there's a lot of machines here. We actually, Friday, broke our record of the most machines ever shipped in one day. We broke that record Friday. That was good, but what was even better than that, we broke it again Monday. <laughs> so, I think so, that calls for chicken sandwiches. That, that's, that definitely calls for chicken sandwiches. <laughs> so, 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 you know, just as soon as we can get cranked back up, we're going to be serving chicken sandwiches back in here. So I think we have another special treat we want to show you. We take this vehicle to shows, to different open houses, but I have a feeling you might want to show it off. Yeah, yeah, we, we built this machine uh, uh, to take the shows for marketing. It's a, it's a really cool product. Just about everyone that comes in the shop wants to get their picture tucked with it. So it's a pretty, pretty good attention getter. So, we wanted to show everyone what we take to these shows. We built this machine here. It's called our assault vehicle. It's a Spartan vehicle. We take it to the shows. It's got your Gatling gun on it. It shoots t-shirts out of it. <laughs> it's got your hand grenades for your steering. It's got your missiles. It's got your missiles on top. It's got your stereo system. This thing is Unbelievable! Almost everybody in the shows we take this to get the picture stuck on it. So it's been a it's been a huge success. It's uh, it's went viral, uh, and um, uh, we're it's we're, got the sound bar. You oh, can yeah. play music while you're out. Huge, yeah. <laughs> yep. And uh, so this is a this is a big attention getter. Uh, here's a machine broke down. We wanted everyone to see what a Spartan was uh, without the shell on it, so you can see how heavy duty everything was. It's pretty so cool. We take this to shows too, yes. and that way. People get an inside look of their mower and yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we, we the special we, features that it has. We cut stuff apart so you can see our scalping wheels are solid, even on our lowest cost machines. We do a lot of extra Spartan that no other company does. We have the lowest price on the planet for the value, and uh, and we're able to do that because we've got the most unbelievable team on the planet. Robert, what do you, what do people say to you oftentimes at shows about when you come out with new year models? Yeah, that well, uh, you know, one of the biggest, one of the biggest, you know, things that I, that I've ever uh, uh, have have said that people's kind of latched on to was uh, um, I made the comment before the first Spartan I ever built back in '16 
that, that um, I wanted every part that we build, if we come up with something new that's exciting, that it will fit on their Spartan. So, so uh, uh, people love that so that they can get a, the first Spartan ever built, and if we come out with two or three new things, you know, 2020, 2021, that will fit right on their Spartan. So I try to make everything interchange. And uh, people love that. I had a guy just at the last uh, event I was at, he come in and said, hey, I would love to have this and this and this. You know, I'd like to trade my Spartan in. Well, we'd like for you to trade your Spartan in, you know, and, and, and update it if, if, if that's what you want. But like I told him, we have the accessories, the same items that you can just bolt to your Spartan. So we, we make everything as possible to interchange. Okay, so we've talked a bunch about mowers, but people probably don't realize we build UTVs too. Yes, we do. We started building UTVs first, and then so we're going to go over and look at UTVs. Uh, we have a new GC1000 that's a, that's a beast in the market. Very, very heavy duty, so let's go check it out. We're going to show you the Intimidator line, but before we do, we want to show you a final product. You yes. were talking about the GC1K. Hey, yeah, this, this is... one looks really familiar. Uh, yeah, this is the one yeah, that... Um, I think it is. You yeah. know what? <laughs> I think this is supposed to belong to marketing. Well, it, it did temporarily. So what happened was um, Janelle was not here one day, and I think I tried to call her to see I if she had to have it. I had no missed call. She said she has no missed call. But, but anyway, that she had this for marketing, and a, a, a dealer came in, and I've kind of got the reputation. If somebody wants something, I kind of sell it to them. So, so that's kind of what worst. happened here, and so she's not letting me live it down yet. No, so, because so. we needed a unit for marketing purposes. When I go to find said unit, it has been so, so, <laughs> and I well, had to hear it from other people, not even him. <laughs> well, hey, let me tell you. Hey, please get off that. <laughs> okay, let me let me tell you a little bit about the machine here. This machine here is our crew cab, and it's got eight ply radials on it. Heavy, heavy duty. Weighs about 400 pounds more than in the competition. Very, very heavy duty. Um, it's um, got a very heavy duty frame system. The brakes are 10 and a quarter inch slip on rotors. Very, very heavy duty. This thing has a thousand horsepower. It's, it's uh, uh, not a thousand, I'm sorry, excuse me. Not a thousand horsepower, a thousand cc. cc. <laughs> Little difference there, little difference there. Wait, but, it's, but it's it's 83 horsepower. It's 83 horsepower. I should have been paying attention. <laughs> I, was, a thousand I was sitting just paying attention. So, so one thing cool about this machine right here is it, it's re, everything's real accessible. So so you literally can just pull a lever, the hood will fold up on you, so you get to access everything. Very very nice. So um, this machine right here. This is the GC1K Stage 2. There are three different stages and a base model, and yeah. you're looking at the Stage 2. Yeah, so we have a Stage 1, Stage 2, and Stage 3, different options on it. So what we're going to do, since we showed you this machine, we'll end up going to the line showing you how the thing's built. And then, um, Hey, uh, you know what else? That's not supposed to be there. Well, I thought it might be cool if you stayed with us this long for you to get a sneak peek of something we're working on. I'm usually the one that does the sneak peeks, and I'm getting hammered all the time about me <laughs> telling stuff too soon or showing stuff too soon. But we're going to show you this vehicle that's going to be super hot. It's one of the coolest it's things that we've ever it. built. Very, very comfortable. And uh, it's going to be coming to the market pretty soon. Pretty Believe soon. me, if you have one of these, you will be the envy of your neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly right. Now, this, this vehicle right here, if you look right here, uh, literally folds down right here, makes a real nice bed here, folds up right here. It's got storage everywhere here, storage. Very, very nice, got cup holders back here. Very, very handy, very smooth riding. It's got large tires, aluminum wheels. It's got a, it's got a seven inch, seven inch touch screen right here. You can actually change the color. So, so, so we do a green and we do an orange trim, a green trim. Then you just punch your code in right here. And uh, so it's got, it's got high beam, low beam, flashers. Horn. It's amazing. <laughs> horn. I like scaring people with a horn. It's got two USB ports. It's got a, uh, uh, a regular plug there. Uh, what's cool about this unit here, if uh, you can literally go online uh, uh, on your display here, and uh, if you look right here, you can actually change the mile per hour that the machine will go, uh, and then you can actually change how fast it gets that mile per hour. And and, uh, and change how fast it stops. So that you, way that helps you with like kids and grandkids. Then you push safe. Oh yeah, yeah. That, keeps that's you very very safe. handy. So it can be programmed to, you know, run 10 mile an hour or run 20 mile an hour. How fast it gets to that point. How fast it stops. Uh, the brakes uh, um, in the uh, in the motor 
and the controllers all link together so it's, it stops very, very well. It's got unbelievable heel. If you're going down a hill, whatever speed you're at, it'll stay at that speed. It, it don't, it don't, it don't free, free roll with you. If you're going down a severe incline, you can let off the, off the gas. You don't have to put your brake on. It'll automatically stop and set the brake automatically. When you get back in, all you do is sit, you know, get in the machine, touch your pedal, and then it, it releases it automatically. You know what, too, Robert? It is the quietest thing. Yeah, the, uh, the gentleman that programmed, this has a Curtis controller, which is the best on the market. He was programming this vehicle, and he said it was the quietest vehicle he's ever been on in his life. So It's amazing. Like, people will be driving through the plant. Next thing I know, someone honks at me. Yeah. I didn't even know they were behind me. It's so quiet. Yeah, yeah so this is a very, very nice vehicle. The comfort is unreal. Sit in. It's got lots and lots of room. It's got tilt steering wheel. It's got storage underneath here. It's got storage here. Underneath the hood, it's got storage. Storage in the back. Cup holder here, a cup holder here. Very, very comfortable vehicle. We end up putting the pedals up, up in the firewall. So when you get on and off, it's real easy on and off. You're not dragging on the pedals. So th this vehicle here is going to be a dream machine for uh, uh, around the neighborhood. Uh, very, very quiet. I think it'd quiet. be super impressive, like at universities, oh, I'm, different I'm, locations. Unreal. People yeah, yeah, would love it. University be huge. Uh, uh, I think now that this is going online, we can settle something once and for all. Because Robert and I have this battle going between which color we think is better. So I believe. These green accents, yes. Yeah, green and look over here. Now, no, you can't. Now. I'm still pitching this. Look, wait, before you <laughs> go with it, look at the seats. Oh, how? Oh, like automotive seats. This piping. <laughs> oh, the color goes with the green so well. And then I guess we can show you the orange one. Yeah. <laughs> Come on over. Yeah. <laughs> this one's Robert's favorite. Yeah, now her presentation was pretty good over there, <laughs> but there's no doubt which one of these looks the best. No, nah, sir. So, so, so I'm I'm actually a gray and orange guy with a little trim of orange. So so you can you can vote online. Uh, uh, just send us a little yeah. message. Tell which us. one you like the best? Tell us which one's and, uh, better. And Look I'll, at these back seats. And, and, and I will let her cry on my shoulder <laughs> after I win this. So. Now, nah, sir, you owe me a chicken sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> Look at these back seats, though. I will tell you, this is so comfortable. I'm a grown person, and this is like super comfy. She's, she's grown. I'm a grown, grown person. person. <laughs> I'm a grown backseat driver. Yeah. With my cup holder right here, I'm ready for 4th of July. Huge, yeah. <laughs> so excited about this product here, so. All right, let's get to the Intimidator line. Okay, here we go, UTV here we line. Here we go, UTV, UTV. Let's go to the middle of the line. What do you say? Yeah, yeah. Let's go here back here so you can see the machine without all the plastic on it. It's a lot quieter right now. That means it's lunchtime. Hey, uh, I want you look right. I want you look right down here. This is a guy that's in charge of this department. What's he doing at lunchtime? He is look out pulling at parts that. at lunchtime. We want everyone's parts to be pulled and shipped the day that they ordered. So, so that shows you dedication. Thank so, you, Brad, for thanks, being on Brad. our virtual thanks, tour. Brad. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we have an awesome we have an awesome parts department. I mean, uh, when I go out on the road, one of the biggest compliments that I get from our company is how, of course, is how awesome Janelle is. Marketing, but, yeah. But marketing, but <laughs> but uh, but but one of the big things too is uh, that they throw in there. They you know they love our parts department. So so these guys are very dedicated. If they got to come in on Saturday, whatever it takes, they're going to get it done. One thing you you know that you'll find out about, you know, Intimidator Spartan. We're going to do whatever it takes. Whatever it takes, we're going to do it. I won't say it to Brad's face, but he is a really good guy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I know another thing we want to show on our way out is the Intimidator mural too, but we'll catch that on our way out. Yes, we will. Oh, check this out. So, so, so we want to show you uh, one of the Intimidators. Uh, uh, this is a heavy, heavy duty. This is going to be one of the truck series. It's got a big, big bed on it. Uh, this has been a very popular rig for us this year. It's got a huge bed Look on it. Look at this giant um, spring thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, very <laughs> heavy duty. Receiver hitch on the front, receiver hitch on the back. Uh, we have the battery, uh, everything up real high here uh, for protection. This has the 1,000 cc engine in it, 83 horse, the highest in the industry, uh, tilt steering wheel. Uh, very, very heavy duty. If we look down here on this machine here, you can see it's got the, it has a 1,000 engine in it. Uh, this is the TGB engine. Uh, very, very uh, uh, excited to have this power plant in our, in our product. They make the, the engine, transmission, 
and CBT. So, so they, they provide CBTs for a lot of the other, you know, uh, people in the industry. But very, very high quality, uh, lots of power, um, very high end. Robert, so. everything I hear is the Intimidator has the beefiest, sturdiest frame. And the cool thing is we manufacture that at our other plant. Exactly, yeah. And, 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 and we'll do another one of these, uh, you know, commercials um, that uh, over to the other plant uh, to, to, to show you how everything's built. We laser cut all the tubes, you know, form everything. I think uh, people would love to see yeah, that. Yeah, it's, it's, it's really cool. That's the, that's the plant that I normally stay at the most. So. That's where all the sparks are. That's exactly right. <laughs> so, so this one here has twin uh, actuators here to dump the bed. So, so a very, very heavy payload, it can, it can dump effortlessly. So very, very nice machine. So we're excited, excited we got this one launched. One thing too, we got this rotor molded dash. So it's actually a full piece with, with air in the middle. Very, very heavy duty. Uh, and um, it's, it's, it's something that don't get damaged easy too, so. Pretty cool. Hey, we need to show you guys the Intimidator break room over here with the mural. It's oh, pretty yeah. awesome. Now we're actually back to the front door and we'll show you, oh, Randy Harris, hi. That was uh, our theme up front earlier was a Spartan theme back here. It's Intimidator theme. So, so we're not completely stocked with all the supplies on this end yet, but, uh, but this, is, this will be the Intimidator theme and uh, where a lot of people that works on this side of the building uses this area here. And then if they work up on the other end of the building, they, they use a Spartan one, so. I want to show you guys one really cool, oh hey, before we finish, Oh yeah. every year we have a dealer meeting and we bring all our dealers in from across the country and we use this as a time to encourage them, tell them more about us as a company. We also use this as a time to reveal our new product line for the new year, but every year we have a theme and this year our theme was all things are possible. So throughout this location and our other location, you'll see banners hanging. Come right here. And on yep. both sides, it, you'll sh you'll, it'll show you that yep. all things are possible. Yep. So Good. the cool thing is we can't do it on our own. And one thing we want to show you is this really awesome, amazing sign that you see when you first walk in the door. So come with us this way. Okay, we want to show you guys the entryway. And I think you're going to really find it very cool. So we put our heads together and surprised Robert when we opened this brand new plant because this phrase is something now anybody that's worked here heard him say over and over and over again. So tell us what this means to you, Robert. Yeah, you know, you know, just when I, you know, think of this, you know, situation that um, uh, of all the stuff in life, uh, you know, the different, um, you know, times we all have struggles, we all have difficulties in our lives, and then, uh, you know, we, we all need to depend on God, and um, and and so. Um, I've, I've said several times, uh, it's, you know, this has not been easy. Uh, it's been a struggle. If it, if, it, if it wasn't a struggle, we would think we had something to do with it. So it's been tough enough, uh, you know, to get all started back over again. It's been tough enough uh, that we had to depend on God. And so, so many times in our lives that, that, that I think God takes us to that place that we have to depend on Him. So if, we, um, uh, if that wasn't the case, none of us would, uh, would, would, would think we needed God. So, so very, very thankful that... Uh, I was so excited when I seen this sign when you first walked <laughs> in, and so it means a lot to our company. You know, we actually have two chaplains at, uh, at our facilities. Uh, where, you know, we, we, we play K-Love radio through the facilities. So, so Another thing we do is we put together quarterly devotional books, and we ship them out to all our salesmen across the country, ship them out to dealers when they request them, and hand them to every employee that works here. And some people might like it, some people don't. I absolutely love it. I just I, think they're inspirational. I love it. If you look on my phone, you'll just see page after page in there. Just this morning, um, you know, I thought of uh, eight or 10 people of what I read that, that meant a lot to me. So if it's one that really means a lot to me, then I'll send it out. So I sent it to several people this morning. So um, uh, it's very encouraging and, uh, you know, we, we're so blessed. Uh, you know, you don't have the team that we have here uh, at, our, at, our, at our company. The atmosphere is really, really good. Um, and, um, uh, you know, we have a lot of, um, um, you know, people that's really dedicated, um, uh, you know, to the company that's, um, you know, more than as dedicated to God. So very thankful for that. Um, I love the fact that you guys went on a virtual tour with us. I'll tell you what, we will do another one of these at our other location. And I'm just thanking you so much for joining us and watching. And we love our products and we love our company. We love where we work and what we do. And we thought you might want a sneak peek too. So. Yeah, yeah. I just always say, 
I'll take passion over anything. So, so, so the, the group that's been assembled here, we're very passionate uh, of what we do. We love what we do. So, so um, I mean, I love education. I love you know having degrees here and there. That's great. But, uh, but passion uh, to me trumps everything. So, so appreciate it very much. I know I know you uh, got valuable time. You took some time to watch this. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks a lot. Mm -hmm.